Autism often exists alongside other conditions, which are referred to as co-occurring or comorbid conditions. Today, we're going to take a closer look at some of the most common co-occurring conditions that can affect children with autism and how they impact daily life. First, it's important to know that co-occurring conditions can vary greatly from one individual to another. Some of the most common ones include ADHD, anxiety, epilepsy, and gastrointestinal issues. However, there are many others, such as sensory processing disorders, sleep problems, and learning disabilities, all of which can influence how a child interacts with the world around them. Let's explore a few of these common conditions and discuss ways we can support children with both autism and their co-occurring conditions. Let's start with ADHD, which is common in autistic children. ADHD affects their ability to focus, stay organized, and manage their impulses. You might notice that your child finds it difficult to sit still, follow directions, or complete tasks. These symptoms can make daily routines, such as getting ready for school or completing homework, more challenging. In fact, children with both autism and ADHD may become easily frustrated when tasks feel overwhelming or confusing. What can help? Creating a structured environment with clear expectations is key. Using visual supports like charts or calendars can help a child visualize their day and understand what's coming next. Regular breaks in movement are also important. For example, giving your child time to release energy through play or physical activity can improve focus when they return to tasks. Remember, Patience and consistent strategies go a long way in helping children with ADHD manage their impulses and attention. Next, let's talk about anxiety, which is another condition that frequently coexists with autism. Children with autism may feel heightened anxiety in unfamiliar situations, social interactions, or when their routines change unexpectedly. This anxiety might manifest in ways that are unique to each child. For some, it's restlessness or irritability. For others, it could mean avoiding certain activities or experiencing meltdowns when they feel overwhelmed. How can we support children dealing with anxiety? One effective approach is creating a predictable routine that reduces uncertainty. Visual schedules can help children anticipate what will happen next, which often eases anxiety. Relaxation techniques, such as deep breathing or using calming sensory tools, can also be useful. Additionally, Teaching coping strategies, like how to express their feelings or ask for help when they feel anxious, can empower children to navigate their emotions with more confidence. It's important to acknowledge that anxiety isn't always something we can eliminate. But by offering tools and strategies, we can help children develop resilience and navigate their anxiety in a way that feels more manageable. Epilepsy is another condition that occurs more frequently in individuals with autism compared to the general population. Epilepsy is characterized by seizures, which can vary from brief staring spells to full body convulsions. For families with children who have both autism and epilepsy, managing seizures becomes a priority, as these episodes can be unpredictable and require close medical attention. If your child has epilepsy, it's important to collaborate closely with healthcare professionals to create a tailored management plan. This includes understanding your child's specific type of seizures, the triggers, and how best to respond. Having a seizure action plan in place ensures that family members, teachers, and caregivers know exactly what to do if a seizure occurs, which can provide peace of mind. In some cases, Medications may be prescribed to control or reduce the frequency of seizures, so regular check-ins with a healthcare provider are essential to monitor your child's progress. Let's move on to gastrointestinal issues, which are common in children with autism. These issues can include constipation, diarrhea, and food sensitivities, which may cause discomfort and affect a child's mood and behavior. Imagine trying to focus on a task or participate in an activity while dealing with stomach pain, it can be a major source of frustration for many children. One way to address GI problems is by paying close attention to your child's diet and identifying any foods that may be causing discomfort. Some families find that working with a nutritionist or healthcare provider helps in creating a diet plan that alleviates these symptoms. For example, making adjustments to fiber intake or identifying food sensitivities can sometimes bring relief. 
It's also helpful to observe any patterns in behavior related to meals and digestion, which can guide conversations with healthcare providers about next steps. Ultimately, managing GI issues can significantly improve a child's comfort and daily experience, so it's well worth seeking guidance if you notice any persistent problems. Remember, supporting a child with autism often means addressing both autism and any co-occurring conditions. Understanding these co-occurring conditions is the first step in providing comprehensive support. Whether your child is dealing with ADHD, anxiety, epilepsy, gastrointestinal issues, or sensory processing difficulties, early diagnosis and intervention can make a significant difference. The earlier these conditions are identified, the sooner you can begin developing strategies that work best for your child. It's also essential to stay connected with healthcare professionals, educators, and therapists. This team approach ensures that your child receives well-rounded care, addressing their needs from multiple angles. By collaborating with experts and staying informed about the latest resources and interventions, you can help your child lead a healthier, more balanced life. Each child with autism is unique, and so are the co-occurring conditions they may face. With the right support, strategies, and interventions, you can help your child overcome the challenges of both autism and their comorbid conditions. While there may be obstacles along the way, remember that every small step towards understanding and managing these conditions contributes to your child's overall well-being. Let's continue to spread awareness, offer support, and advocate for the best possible care for all children on the spectrum, ensuring they can thrive in all areas of life. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe. For further questions and inquiries, you may contact us at 6100-2665 or visit www.cognitive.com.sg.